First Canadian liquor stores expressed interest in selling recreational cannabis. Now pharmacies are hoping to take part in the nation's green rush as well. According to the Canadian Pharmacists Association, the Neighbourhood Pharmacy Association of Canada, and some of the country's largest drugstore chains, including Shoppers Drug Mart, pharmacies are the best option to provide patients with medical cannabis. According to Alan Austin, a spokesman for the Neighbourhood Pharmacy Association of Canada, which represents Rexall, IDA and others, pharmacists are experts in medication and medication management. Our members have the systems and processes in place to manage medications including monitoring, tracking usage, and being aware of drug interactions, he said. According to the Globe and Mail, at least one pharmacy chain, Shoppers Drug Mart, is already talking with suppliers about perhaps distributing medical cannabis in the chain's 1,300 stores across Canada. Currently, only a small number of producers are legally allowed to grow and provide cannabis to patients via mail. Giving people the options to fill their prescriptions at pharmacies would eliminate time spent waiting for shipments. But according to pharmacy associations and their members, it's also a safer option. However, according to Colette Rivet, executive director of the Canadian Medical Cannabis Industry Association, cannabis sold in pharmacies would be more expensive as they have large overheads and add a dispensing fee. She added that it would be impossible for pharmacies to stock all the strains currently available to patients through online retailers. Rivet also pointed out that pharmacies were given the option of participating in the distribution system when the new regulations were introduced in 2013, but they refused. Previously, Prime Minister Justin Trudeau, Ontario Premier Kathleen Wynne and others have suggested that recreational cannabis could be sold in booze stores. However, the government hasn't laid out specifics for its legalization plan expected next year. The Liberals have also not yet made any mention of changes to the medical cannabis system.